The debate on QR codes. Should you use them? And if you do use them, where should you use them? Because of COVID, we all got very used to being able to use QR codes, right? Like they became quite commonplace in day-to-day -day life. And I definitely think they have a huge value in some ways, but often I think they can be overused. I actually think even in our own booklet here, we've actually overused them slightly. And, and here's why. So think of the QR code at Nando's, for example, right? You sit down, the only way to order your food at Nando's really is to scan the QR code and it pulls it up. QR codes that encourage you, that kind of you have to use to use the system that you're using are perfect. And it worked great for COVID, it worked in those settings. But to build QR codes into a document like this, I think it can be quite difficult to actually put them in the right place for people to actually use them and actually scan them. So when you're thinking about building QR codes into your sales process, where can you build those QR codes where uh, you are actively encouraging people to scan them and use them as part of the system, but don't overuse them in places. So just because you think, oh, maybe I could add one and add a little bit more information because the likelihood is, is that they're not going to get scanned and they're just not going to get watched.